Hello everybody, it's me XPC and welcome to Fusion Fall Retro, the tutorial. So right now, as of 3.30am, uh, uh, the tutorial is finally out for Fusion Fall Retro, and I am very excited to play it. And yeah, the, f as of right now, it's only the tutorial for Fusion Fall Retro, so uh, but that's, just, that's pretty much it. We're just going to play that, essentially. So. Yeah, so like throughout the entire day they were making constant updates and saying, you know, a lot of stuff. So they eventually decided on, hey, we're going to give you the tutorial today and we're going to give you the other stuff in spades throughout the week. So, yeah, and if you can, if you can hear in my voice, I'm very tired right now. So, alright, so I'm going to make XPC Gamer and I'm going to space that out. So I was recording this earlier, but I realized my mic was not even plugged in. So yeah, I'm sorry if it seems a little forced. So we're gonna go with that setup name, and our clothes will be. So I'm a boy, gonna be a medium, medium here as well. Asparagus, so kind of. What kind of hairstyle is asparagus? That's, that's more like spike to me. But um, where is it? A uh, clean cut. Alright, so I could be prizzified for a day with that shirt over there, but nah, nah. We're gonna, we're gonna do our own thing. See, it. let's see this over here. Was I was wearing this, and then. Let me see here. There we go. Alright. There we go. Hair color. Not, no, sorry. Eye color. Skin tone. There we go. Hair color. It's so good to see this game again, honestly. Like, it's been four years since I last saw this game. Because I didn't get to play retro in this um, beta alpha stage, so. Right? We're good. Excellent. Is complete. Let's make sure your communicator is functioning. All communication systems are functional, Dexter. I will be able to reconnect with the volunteer upon arrival in the future. You know, I see. It's, it's kind of weird that you would volunteer for a time travel experiment. Possibly risking your life for this. But, uh. Honestly, I would kind of do that too, so. Oh man. So good to so good to hear that. Fine day for science. Oh, DD, you know why? You gotta ruin everything, DD. Right, there we go, your time jump error. Oh boy. DD has messed up for good. It has propelled us too far into the future. Error, you have been sent much farther into the future than Dexter intended. Mm-hmm. Too far into the future. Hey, it's Tech Square. Watch out. I wish we, I wish we got to like have that Tech uh, Square version that was in like the beta. If you've seen it, um, you know what I'm talking about. By the way, if you've seen Fusion Fall Legacy's Tech Square, oof, it looks so good. Like the, especially the Skybox and Number Five's armor that she wears too. So good. Alright, so let's go to be back. Three miles to the left, we move forward. Four miles back. W key. So yeah, I always go with the I always go with the dub the W A S D keys. You can steer left and right by using the mouse. Yeah, there we go. Excellent. You can also move side to side to jump. Press the There you go, jump up here, jump up here. There we go. Alright, thank you. Yeah, give me this, give me this gun. Can't fight with my hands now, can I? Oh, I can, but, um... Yeah, you can also punch in this game. Like, if you have no weapon, you can still punch in this game, so... But it's, uh, less effective. But Ben over there is punching him. By the way, people say that, hey... 
Ben is weak without his Omnitrix. This man still knows Kung Fu. He still knows Kung Fu, okay? Even without his Omnitrix. So, yeah. <clears throat> Lots of tutorial stuff. I like how they're just sitting and staring at me. I wish you could wear glasses, like, as right now, but you don't get those, like, kind of stuff yet. In the tutorial, anyway, so. Ben is punching a metal monster. That sounds great. Here we go, you're down, Cybris. Thank you. Realize who you are. You're the kid from the past Dexter told us about. Well, you're in a world of trouble now. I am Look up in the sky. That's Planet Fusion. Ruled by some nasty guy named Fuse. Uh oh. Covered the world with gross I like this I like these cutscenes are really cool. Fuse's monsters have evolved and adapted to our planet. Yeah, after the tutorial there's not much like voice acting acted related like like voice acting related cutscenes or whatever what not there's not there's none of those after the tutorial they're just missions and everything that's okay I need some help with a super important mission report to me right away it sounds like that would be a lot of a big hassle to have all those voices do a bunch of lines and stuff so we're gonna they're gonna Leave it at that, so. So, I've always wondered what was always, what was around here. I wanna explore that. Why not? I'm not much here, honestly. You got the fountain right over here. Wonder. Ooh, there's a big... Look for the glowing pit down there. To help you find oh, invisible two. walls. Alright, we're gonna head to number two. And see what his mission is for us. Because I do want a mission. Right, come up over here. To talk to number two, get characters with there you go. For you. This attack was no accident. I love that. I love that line so much. This attack was no accident. Yes, I will get your transmitter back for you. Don't worry, number two. I will get on that right away. You know, number two can easily defeat him. Why does he need me to do this? Okay, Mr. Oil Ogre. Um, I, you, you have uh, something I need. So I really, I really want that back. How are you hitting me from there, sir? I'm like all the way here. I would love to bring it back. This is the main menu. Got a journal. Yeah, I always forget this is like a game made for kids. So, yeah, even though most of the community, like, people were, like, adults and everything. Like, but, like, I was 13 when this game came out, and now I'm 17. So, yeah. And it must, m most of us are adults, because we played this game a long time ago. But this was a kid, this is, this was a kid's game, so. Hence why it's so simple to use.